Hello, in this video I will show you how to create a click tag for DoubleClick Campaign Manager in an HTML5 display ad using Google Web Designer. The first step is to add a tap area component to your canvas. You're going to want to make sure that you have selected the first frame in your timeline before you add the tap area, otherwise it will be sized differently across your entire canvas. When you add the tap area, you're going to want to make sure that the tap area covers the entire canvas because you don't want somebody who clicked outside of your call to action to not be taken anywhere. If you have multiple calls to action on your page and you need multiple different destination URLs, that's possible. However, it's outside the scope of today's video. So I'm going to first set the position of my tap area to 0, 0, and then I'm going to set the width and height to be the width and height of my ad, in this case 300 by 250. Once my tap area is in place, now I need to add an event to be triggered when somebody clicks or taps on the ad. So under the event subpanel, while I have the tap area selected, I simply click the plus sign to add an event. I want to add a tap area event of touch or click so that it doesn't matter if somebody is using a mouse or their finger. They will activate the ad. From here, the action that I want to select is a Google Ad action followed by Exit Ad. This will make sure that when the ad is placed in DoubleClick Campaign Manager that the proper URL is inserted into the ad. From here, I'm only given one option of GWD Ad. Finally, I enter a metrics ID Usually I enter click tag, followed by a URL. This URL is arbitrary but it, because it will be overridden by DoubleClick Campaign Manager. Um, finally click OK and publish your ad. And you should be all set.